keep the bishop and um, probably I should do it mm, but I kind of like the end game even more here he has another chance with f5 the point is that he can bouquet the d5 and I don't have any counter play and he can improve slowly on d file slowly um, you know something like this and and he will have queen and bishop at the end against uh, you know my my bishop is bad his his bishop is good he would probably win the game um but okay the end game was he played some accurate inaccurate moves and um give me the chance and here here he goes rook b1 just maybe too tired from the tournament and a nice checkmate at the end who can believe I if you if you say me that i'm gonna meet him yeah i have jody you can add me on, like a friend only chess i will be happy um so I if you say me that um i'm gonna meet him like this when we're starting i, I would never believe <laughs> So this was the end of the game and uh, yes, I hope you enjoy it. I'm gonna go to a lunch now, um, probably I'm gonna stream later some chess, maybe analyze some more games. Yes, thank you for watching and uh, yeah, actually I can analyze one more game. I played against Wesley So yesterday i was so lucky to play against him this was tournament with 400 so i played from with a player from top 10 actually top 10 um let's analyze the game against wesley soul um where is this game wesley soul yes i'm i'm gonna analyze also this game Wow, I almost have a draw there. <laughs> okay. So, the story about this game. Or maybe I should make another video. What do you think? Make another video or no? Um... Oh, there are some commentators on the Berserk. Hype, no Berserk. Yatsi, Berserk, yeah, let's go. Seriously? Against Soldier, whoa. Soldier is dead, rip. <laughs> Does Soldier know who is he is playing? <laughs> yeah, I did not know I, I was playing G voice selection. I didn't read the name. I just saw the rating, 900. Oh, I said, oh, come on, I'm going to beat this guy. Soldier is trolling, free moving against the GM, okay. For the glory, he has no idea, whoa. <laughs> I bet Wesley doesn't know about Berserking, he does, probably, he won't win because of that. Yes, yeah, Soja, let's go. Mini Karpov, oh, he's worth his game. Damn, Soja's playing well. Wow, he was bad, man. GG, GG, GG. Good up until the mate. <laughs> GG, he had mate in one. As I had the mate in one? No, I couldn't. What is the fast analysis? Okay. Uh, uh. So I did play Wesley So without knowing that Wesley So, can you believe this? I played against this guy. Let me show you. GM Wesley So yesterday. And I almost have a draw. I played against this guy. He's from top 10 in the world. And I almost made a draw against him. Uh, almost. He, and he's playing with the greats in the world. Um, oh, oh, furious, furious, Wesley saw. Yes. Um,
So rankings, let's see rankings. Obviously so rankings. So I played yesterday and almost make a draw against 2773 rating. And uh, he's uh, which place in the world? In the world number 10. Uh, so I can say I play against a guy from number 10 in the world. Uh, in number 3 in USA. And uh, Grandmaster since 2008. Mm. Birth of, oh, he's younger than me. 1993. Wow. Crazy. He's crazy. Is he crazy? Uh, he was even number seven in the world. How old is he? So I'm I'm twenty six. It's nineteen ninety three. Four years. He's twenty two years old. Twenty two years old in top ten. Can you believe this? In 21 years he was in top uh, ten, top 7 in the world. Anyway, I played against him and um, I played this Gambit, Blackburn Gambit, which um, I don't know, I have a good success against, against weak players. <laughs> okay, and I didn't know I'm playing against him, I was berserking, you know, 900, why not? And um, so we get this position. I wasn't sure about rook c7, okay. He goes back, b5. Um, oh, he could take here. But he pre-moved there. Um, yeah. <laughs> okay, rook c8. Uh, so, I felt like I have some advantage. Here. Here I, I felt I'm okay. After queen b3. I I hear I hear I have even advantage against him. Oh, this mate! Can you believe I don't I didn't see the mate? <laughs> oh man! But it was drawish. If I wasn't, oh man! <laughs> but a very nice tactic for a mate, actually. Instead of taking, I just never thought that it's gonna be made. It, it was kind of unique, made. Kind of unique. I, you see, instead of taking rook f7, he, he goes 96. If I go here. And maybe he's still, yeah, maybe I do have chance. Okay, so this is for uh, for the fans of Wesley Saw and Blackburn Gambit. Um, and let's read about this Blackburn Gambit before I go. Um, Blackburn Gambit is drinking Blackburn or what? Uh, Italian game Blackburn, no. Blackbird Gambit in uh, Scandinavian. Um, wiki. Okay. So yeah, I'm so lucky to play against him. Such an honor, guys. Such an honor. Born in Manila, Philippines. Um, let's write Blackburn. <laughs> so, main wine. 
Uh, white normally continuously takes d5 when black has two major crusades, knight fc, marshal gambit. The, the rare move c6 was played successfully by Joseph Blackburn on at least one occasion, but it's tough to be unsound after d takes c6 and it's almost never seen in master level play. Yeah, guys, do you know what? You just see Blackburn gambit in a in a master level play. <laughs> Me against Wesley Saul. <laughs> You see, last time, first time we see, we, we have to change the Wikipedia. Um, okay, so thank you to Joseph Blackburn. Um, Joseph Henry Blackburn, September, nicknamed the Black Dad. The Black Dad dominated British chess during the later part of the 19th century. He won the game at Travity 8 the age 18 but quickly became a strong player mm. it, um, at one point he was the world's second most successful with a string of tournament victories behind him um, he was also a collection a published a collection of his own games biography uh, he was born in Manchester he wanted how to play draws as child he heard about Paul Murphy Hmm. Okay. Blackburn uh, playing against Wolfgang Steinitz. Top five in the world. Um, the Blackburn Shilling Gambit. E4, E5, Knight, F3, Knight, F6, Bishop, C4, Knight, D4. I don't knew that. That it's a Gambit. Mm hmm. It's estimated that Blackburn played 100 games in his career more than any other professional chess player. Unreliable source. However, he still had to marry three times and with his second wife, Beatrice Wafty, he had son, Julius. And with his third wife, Mary Goodway, near Fox, another son, Frederick. Wow, married three times. Not losing his time. <laughs> The dubious chess opening, the Blackburn Gambit, has been named for Blackburn because his okay. writings. He had written uh, Final Years and 72 Special Brilliancy Prize for his. He had beat Nimchovic. Um, that same year, he tied for the first in British Championship. Uh, Was King Simulation Exhibition. His wife died. He died of heart on 1 September. He his buried the block 92. Okay. Um, Blackburn is an icon of romantic chess because of his white open and highly tactical style of play. His large black beard and aggressive style earned him the nickname of uh, Oh, because of his black beard. The Black Death. Yeah. <laughs> After his performance in 1873 Vienna tournament. In 1881, according to one of retrospective rating calculation, he was the second most successful player in the world. He was especially strong at end games and had a great com it's uh, he's like me <laughs> almost great comedic ability which enabled him to win many brilliant prizes, but he will be best remembered for his popular Simulation and blindfold displays which captured the imagination of the general public who fought to watch him. Mr. Brain Games Chess, which he published, reprinted Moravian Chess. It contained 400 of his games, around 20 problems. A new book about him was published in 2015. It contains over 1,000 of his games, more than 50 problems of his wife, family, and career. Okay. Uh huh. He didn't qualify it. One done. 